show you how to make butter in your KitchenAid mixer. Essentially, butter is made with one ingredient, cream. After churned, the cream will turn into its solid fats and buttermilk. The solid fats are butter. I've added the proper attachments and the splash guard. Definitely don't forget that. And now I'm gonna put it on the highest speed for 10 minutes. I wanted to stop the mixer just to show you where we're at. So it's been 10 minutes. We're at whipped cream. It goes to another step before butter, stiff peaks, and then butter. And it goes quickly. So I would say a matter of two, three minutes, we'll have butter. So as we can see, the buttermilk separated and we have butter. So what we're gonna do right now is we're going to remove the attachment and scrape off the butter. Put a little bit in there. And as you can see, we've got buttermilk. So we're gonna drain that off. Okay, so after we pressed the butter, we drained everything, now we're going to wash it. Yes, we're gonna wash it. We're gonna do this two or three times, and we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna press the butter until the water is clear. I went to my friend Beth's house, and she taught me how to make homemade butter with her grandmother's churner. We had so much fun. It was like going back in time and just a little arm power with, with turning it, but we just really had a good time, and she inspired me to make this video. And now I'm making butter. You can always buy a butter mold or a little crock like I have. I generally leave it out on the counter all the time. And I'm here to say there's so many ways you can flavor butter. You can just put a little Himalayan salt, you can put herbs, you can make a sweet butter with honey. There's so many different ways to flavor. That's just up to you. But I hope this video inspires you to make homemade butter.